Aloha. About three weeks ago, I asked my husband to help me with this song. It's a special song for such a special person in my life. His birthday is tomorrow, and we had, yeah, about three weeks to, to write it. And my uncle, so special. And he has been a part of my life and my siblings' lives since we were born. He's a really good friend of my dad's. And what I've learned from him is music. That was a huge part of it. He's a good person, such a generous heart. He is very wise. You know, I remember we went to his home and we were making haupia and the coconut we were shredding was like flying all over the place, lose money. And he disappears, comes back, and he made this plexiglass box that really helped us. And it's just quick thinking. He is a contractor by trade. So it's not just that, it's just how clever he is to, I guess with all of his experience. But with him, he also loves the Hawaiian culture. He is very, he volunteers a lot of his time to like tarot patches. And he also, the main thing with this song is he learned to make ukuleles. And he would invite uh, my brothers and my cousin to come over to his beautiful wood shop. And, and he would teach them how to make ukuleles. And again, he's a contractor, so he had to learn on his own. And so uh, it was amazing. My, my brother, Danny, just yesterday sent me a picture of his ukulele that he's holding and my cousin, and they made it at this wood shop. But it's just a connection that is made. I can only imagine that you can play, you can sing, you can make your own ukulele like Brother Josh Kekoa. Thank you so much for coming in. He only had like not even 24 hours to learn this song, to play the ukulele and do the riffs. Thank you so much. He is so talented. Josh is a professional ukulele builder too. He worked for G-String Ukulele. And so that's what makes him very different. He's an amazing ukulele player and he also can make his own. So what a connection. Uh, my uncle also invited legendary artists and you know just sitting there and listening to them really inspired me so again he's instrumental in me wanting to learn more and more so my husband let me listen to the song and i i loved it the, and one thing i wanted was the chorus to be uh strong and that was the fastest part. He just, okay, what, it, what about this? You know, like F and G, F and G. And two chords, it's amazing what you can do melodically just with those two chords. And it takes me to the top of my vocal range and it's the equivalent to like Star Spangled Banner. You know how high that goes. So it's my favorite part, but the difficult part of the song. So then I had to look at the chords and I was playing it and I was thinking, well, what am I writing about? And I turned the ukulele and I said, that's what I'm gonna write about. The different parts of the ukulele, the different kinds of ukulele. Like this is, a, this is not a baritone, but a baritone is called ha-oi. And ni au nui is like the bridge of the ukulele. And kaula is the strings. So evalu kaula, I have an eight string baritone ukulele that he made for me as well as a tenor ukulele. Papaki ukulele, papaki is where you tune the ukulele. So I decided, I imagine my uncle pressing and putting this ukulele together. So sporadically within the mele, you'll hear different words that might not sound familiar because it is the different parts of the ukulele. And the hidden meaning is my uncle. And after I wrote it, now I do not speak Olelo Hawaii, so I need help all the time because I don't know how to put in the tense. I don't know how to create a, you know, a complete sentence. So I have my kako'o, my kumu, that when I ask for his help, he's always readily available. And I cannot thank you enough. My kumu is Frank, Hawaii Kapo Kalani Hewitt. And he's always there to say, okay, what are you trying to say in this part? Or, you know, this is how it's his past tense. 
and I, I am a songwriter and I cannot, I run out of words to thank you, Kumu. So mahalo nui loa, I thank you so much for your help. Gary and I both thank you. So Kumu helped me with the song and we put it together. We recorded it yesterday. <laughs> it's so last minute. And I'm getting even long, more long-winded, I notice. But we give you this song. I entitled it No Eyao. My uncle is, the, the meaning of No Eyao is skillful, clever, wise. And just so happened that my uncle, my only living uncle, my dad's brother's Hawaiian name is No Eyao. And about 18 years ago, my two brothers, Danny and Butter and Keola, we had this group called Noeao. But Noeao means wise, clever, and skillful. So this is for my uncle Masami Kochi. We wish you the best. Happy birthday tomorrow. And you mean so much to me. Thank you so much for everything you've done for me and for my siblings and my parents and for Kauai. Love you, Uncle. Have a great day.